ever pondered why some men prefer solitude over social gatherings? I'll reveal the secret to unlocking your inner Sigma male and dominating every aspect of your life. Welcome to the intriguing world of Sigma males, a distinct personality type that often gets overlooked in the social hierarchy. Sigma males are those rare individuals who value independence and self-reliance above all else. The term Sigma male emerged from the Greek alphabet where Sigma represents sum or total, signifying their holistic approach to life. Now, it's crucial to debunk some common misconceptions. Sigma males are not antisocial or reclusive. They simply choose quality over quantity when it comes to social interactions. They are the introverted mavericks, the lone wolves who thrive in their own company. But that doesn't mean they shy away from meaningful connections. Sigma males are introspective, self-aware and self-driven, living life on their own terms. They don't conform to societal norms, rather they create their own path, marching to the beat of their own drum. So, are you a Sigma male? Or do you know one? Stay with us as we delve deeper into their biggest struggles. Imagine preferring a quiet night in, while the world buzzes with party invitations. The Sigma male, in his natural habitat, is a creature of solitude. He thrives in his own space, where he is the master of his own universe. But let's not get it twisted. This is not about shyness or social anxiety. No, this is about a preference a choice to be one's own company. In a world that seems to be in a never-ending race of social extravaganzas, this preference for solitude often leaves the Sigma male on the outskirts. Society, with its extroverted ideals, has a hard time understanding why someone would willingly choose the quiet over the clamor, the solitude over the crowd. The Sigma male's struggle isn't about fitting into society, it's about society fitting into the Sigma male's world. It's about understanding that the love for solitude is not a sign of antisocial behavior, but rather a request for space, for time to recharge, to think, to create. Now let's take a moment to debunk a common misconception. Solitude for the Sigma male is not a retreat from the world. It's not an escape from reality. It's a space where they can breathe, where they can be themselves without the pressure of societal expectations. It's a space where they can unravel the complexities of their thoughts, where they can explore the depths of their imagination, where they can simply be. But this misunderstanding often leads to misconceptions about the Sigma male. They are labeled as aloof, detached, even antisocial. The Sigma male isn't antisocial, he's selectively social. He values meaningful interactions over small talk, deep connections over casual acquaintances. He doesn't avoid people, he avoids superficial interactions. The Sigma male's struggle lies in this misunderstanding. It's a struggle to be understood in a world that values noise over silence, crowds over solitude, small talk over meaningful conversations. But remember, for the Sigma male, solitude is not a prison, it's a sanctuary. Solitude is not isolation for a Sigma male, it's a cherished choice. Ever felt like a maverick misunderstood in a world that loves conformity? Well. Welcome to the reality of the Sigma male. They are the lone wolves, the offbeat ones, the misunderstood mavericks. Sigma males often face the challenge of being misunderstood due to their non-conformist attitudes. While the world buzzes with social butterflies, Sigma males prefer the quiet corners, observing, reflecting, and thinking deeply. And society, which often values extroverted tendencies and conformity, can find this hard to grasp. Imagine this. You're at a party, and everyone's chattering away. But you prefer to just observe and listen. You find joy in your own thoughts, and you don't feel the need to be the life of the party. You're comfortable in your own skin, marching to the beat of your own drum. But the world often misunderstands this. People might mistake your quiet observation for aloofness or arrogance. But you're just being you, a Sigma male, and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. The pressure to conform can be immense. Society often dictates how we should act, behave, and even think. But Sigma males, they defy these societal norms and expectations. They don't seek validation from others. They seek it from within. They don't follow the crowd. They carve their own path. And this independent thinking and self-reliance can be a hard concept for society to understand and accept. But here's the thing. Sigma males are not trying to be difficult or deliberately rebellious. 
they just value authenticity over popularity. They prefer deep, meaningful interactions over surface-level banter. They choose to live their truth, even if it means being misunderstood. So, yes, being a misunderstood maverick can be tough, but it's also liberating. It's a testament to their strength and individuality. It's a declaration of their independence and self-reliance. And most importantly, it's a celebration of their uniqueness. Being a misunderstood maverick may be tough, but Sigma males wouldn't have it any other way. Because at the end of the day, they understand that being true to oneself is the most important thing, and they wouldn't trade their individuality for anything else. What happens when you are a riddle wrapped in a mystery inside an enigma? You become a Sigma male, an emotional enigma often misunderstood by society. A common misconception is that Sigma males are emotionally detached, that they are as cold as an arctic breeze. But is that really the case? The reality is that Sigma males are not devoid of emotions. They are human, after all. Their emotional landscape is as vast and profound as anyone else's. They feel joy, sadness, love and anger just like everyone else. However, they process and express these feelings differently. They prefer to keep their emotions to themselves, to introspect and understand them before sharing, if they choose to share at all. Their emotional self-sufficiency often leads to misunderstandings. Society, accustomed to open and frequent displays of emotion, perceives their reticence as coldness or indifference. But it's not that Sigma males don't care, it's just that they express their emotions in subtler ways. This emotional enigma presents a unique set of challenges for Sigma males, particularly when it comes to forming deep, meaningful relationships. It's not that they are incapable of such connections, but their reluctance to openly share their emotions can make it difficult for others to understand them, to truly connect with them. But here's the thing, Sigma males don't just wear their hearts on their sleeves. They need time, trust, and a deep connection before they open up their emotional vault. They prefer to express their emotions through actions rather than words. A thoughtful gesture, a quiet act of kindness, a steady presence in times of crisis. These are the ways a Sigma male says, I care. So the next time you encounter a Sigma male, remember that beneath that calm, composed exterior lies a rich, vibrant inner world, a world full of emotions, thoughts and experiences just waiting to be explored. But you'll need to earn the privilege to see it. It's not a journey for the faint-hearted, but for those who dare, it's a journey worth undertaking. An emotional enigma, Sigma males may be, but they do have a rich inner world. They are not cold or indifferent, they just communicate their emotions differently. And that's what makes them, well, Sigma males. In a world that loves labels, how do you resist being boxed? This, my friends, is the biggest struggle for the Sigma male the lone wolf of the personality spectrum. Imagine this, you're an artist, but the world around you is trying to force you into the mold of an accountant. There's nothing wrong with being an accountant, of course, but it's simply not who you are. This is the daily reality for the Sigma male. They're the round pegs in the square holes, the individuals who don't fit neatly into the commonly accepted societal roles, and they wouldn't have it any other way. The struggle for self-identity is a crucial aspect of the Sigma male's journey. They are not rebels without a cause, but rather individuals who value their uniqueness and independence. They refuse to be defined by others' expectations and instead choose to forge their own paths. But let's not sugarcoat it. It can be a lonely road. The world is often unkind to those who dare to be different. Sigma males may face misunderstandings and misjudgments, but they remain steadfast in their commitment to their own identity. They are not swayed by the crowd, nor are they influenced by the fleeting trends of society. They remain true to themselves, and that is their biggest strength. In the grand tapestry of life, Sigma males are the vibrant threads that add depth and dimension. They are the individuals who dare to question, to explore, to seek the truth, even if it goes against the grain. They are the ones who remind us that it's okay to be different, that it's okay to be ourselves. So to all the Sigma males out there, I say this, hold on to your unique identity, treasure it, nurture it, celebrate it. Don't let the world's labels define you. You are not a category, a stereotype, or a label. 
You are you in all your complexity and beauty. In the face of categorization, Sigma males stand firm in their unique identity. Because after all, isn't that what life is all about? Being true to who we are. What happens when your career path doesn't fit the traditional mold? Welcome to the career conundrum that many Sigma males often find themselves grappling with. The world of work is dominated by structures, hierarchies, and set routines. But what if you're a square peg trying to fit into a round hole? What if you're a Sigma male, an independent thinker, an introverted leader who thrives on autonomy and flexibility? Well, you're not alone. The traditional nine to five job can feel stifling for Sigma males. They crave independence. They thrive on flexibility and they value the ability to work on their own terms. This doesn't mean they're not hard workers. Quite the opposite, in fact. Sigma males are often incredibly dedicated and focused. They just need the space to do things their way. But the world of work doesn't always accommodate such non-conformity. Sigma males often face challenges in navigating their careers due to these unconventional tendencies. They may struggle to find their place in rigid hierarchies or feel misunderstood by colleagues who don't understand their need for solitude and independence. Yet, it's not all doom and gloom. There's a flip side to this career conundrum. When Sigma males find careers that match their independent nature, they can truly shine. They flourish in roles that offer autonomy, that allow them to work independently, and that value their unique perspectives. Think of careers that allow for flexibility and autonomy. Freelance work, consulting, entrepreneurship, or roles within companies that value independent thinking and innovation. These are the arenas where Sigma males can truly thrive. They can set their own schedules, work at their own pace, and most importantly, be true to their Sigma nature. The career path may be less traveled, but Sigma males make their own way. They carve out their own niches, they create their own opportunities, and they redefine what a successful career looks like. It's not always easy, but for Sigma males, the journey is just as important as the destination. So, remember, the career path may be less traveled, but Sigma males make their own way. How do you form connections when you value your independence so much? This is the question that Sigma males often grapple with, a conundrum that can make the social landscape feel like a treacherous terrain. Sigma males are known for their independent nature. They prefer solitude over social gatherings, introspection over small talk. But this doesn't mean they don't yearn for connections. Quite the contrary. Sigma males have an inherent desire for meaningful relationships, a bond that goes beyond surface level conversation. They seek a connection that resonates with their unconventional mindset, a bond that offers them the freedom to be their authentic selves. Yet, the path to forming these connections is riddled with challenges. For one, Sigma males are highly selective when it comes to friendships and relationships. They don't settle for mediocrity or superficiality. They value quality over quantity, depth over breadth. This selectiveness often translates into a smaller social circle, fewer friendships, fewer relationships. But each connection is special, each bond is profound. Another struggle is the Sigma male's natural inclination towards independence. They treasure their solitude, their time alone to reflect and recharge. Balancing this need for solitude with the desire for companionship can be a delicate dance. It's a dance that requires understanding, patience, and mutual respect. Sigma males also grapple with the societal expectation of constant connectivity. In our digital age, where everyone is just a click away, the Sigma male's preference for solitude can often be misunderstood as aloofness or indifference. This misunderstanding can create barriers, hindering the Sigma male's ability to form meaningful connections. But despite these struggles, Sigma males aren't deterred. They continue to navigate the social landscape in their own unique way, unapologetically embracing their independent nature while cherishing the deep connections they form. They understand that their path may be less trodden, their journey may be less conventional, but that's what makes it uniquely theirs. While they may not have a large circle, Sigma males cherish the few deep connections they form. And in the end, isn't that what truly matters? How do you accept yourself in a world that doesn't understand you? This question, my friends, is the quintessential conundrum faced by our Sigma males. 
when the whole world seems to march to the beat of one drum, Sigma males sway to their own rhythm. They've always been different, and that's what makes their journey to self-acceptance so fascinating. Sigma males are like lone wolves. They prefer their own company and are at peace in their solitude. This solitude is not because they dislike others, but rather because they value their own space and independence. They are introspective and self-reliant, drawing strength from their own internal world. But let's not mistake this for an easy ride. The path to self-acceptance is often riddled with self-doubt and second-guessing. It's a struggle to accept your uniqueness when the world around you seems to value conformity. And Sigma males, with their unique personality and perspective, often find themselves caught in this struggle. Yet it's through this struggle that they truly start to understand and accept themselves. How so, you ask? Well, it's through their introspective nature. Sigma males spend a lot of time in their own heads, dissecting their thoughts, understanding their feelings. This introspection allows them to understand their unique traits, their strengths, and their weaknesses. And once they understand these, they start to embrace them. They recognize that their unique personality is not a flaw, but a strength. They realize that their independence and self-reliance are assets, not liabilities. They understand that their solitude is not loneliness, but peacefulness. This, my friends, is the journey of self-acceptance for Sigma males. It's a journey that's unique to them, a journey that's full of introspection and self-discovery. It's a journey that allows them to embrace their unique personality, to accept their solitude, and to find peace in being themselves. But remember, this journey is not a destination. It's a continuous process, a never-ending exploration of self. It's about constantly adapting, evolving and growing, and that's what makes it so exciting and so rewarding. Self-acceptance is a journey, and Sigma males are on a unique path. So, we've journeyed through the world of Sigma males and their struggles. What have we learned? Well, we've delved into the deepest corners of the Sigma male psyche, peeling back layer after layer to reveal the core of this intriguing personality type. We've seen that the Sigma male's biggest struggle is often his solitude, a trait so inherent to his nature that it often isolates him from the rest of the world. But as we've discovered, this solitude is not a weakness, but a strength, a testament to the Sigma male's independence and self-reliance. We've also explored the misunderstood maverick, the Sigma male who marches to the beat of his own drum, often misunderstood by society. But as we saw, this maverick isn't a rebel without a cause, but a non-conformist with a purpose, a man who values his individuality and isn't afraid to be different. Then we delved into the emotional enigma of the Sigma male, a man whose feelings are often as complex as a labyrinth. He might appear aloof or detached, but beneath that cool exterior lies a world of emotions just waiting to be understood. One of the most poignant struggles we discussed was the Sigma male's search for self-identity. In a world that often tries to fit him into a box, the Sigma male is on a constant quest to understand who he is and where he fits in. It's a struggle, yes, but it's also a journey of self-discovery that can lead to profound personal growth. In terms of career, We've seen how the Sigma male often grapples with finding a path that aligns with his values and allows him to work independently. It's a conundrum, but one that many Sigma males are able to solve with creativity and resilience. We've also touched on the Sigma male's struggles to connect, a challenge that arises from his introverted nature and preference for solitude. But as we've seen, Sigma males are capable of forming deep and meaningful connections when they find people who understand and appreciate them for who they are. Finally, we embarked on the journey to self-acceptance, perhaps the most important struggle of all. For Sigma males, learning to accept their unique traits and quirks is a vital step towards happiness and fulfillment. So what's the takeaway from all this? Well, despite their struggles, Sigma males are unique and valuable members of society. They're independent, introspective, and incredibly resilient. They may not fit the conventional mold, but that's precisely what makes them so special. Remember, whether you're a Sigma male or no one, understanding and acceptance make all the difference.